All right, so I did the um, panoramic stitching project, and basically the goal of this assignment was to create a panoramic stitching effect by taking multiple images of the same location, but at slightly different angles of rotation, and then um, stitching them together, um, basically cutting and pasting them on top of each other. Um, and this was done by first, um, you need to find four corresponding pairs of coordinates in each of the two images. Um, and then um, by solving the system of equations as we did, um, in class, and we used those variables in the perspective warping matrix. Um, a second image was warped or projected um, into the same perspective as the first. And uh, the reason you need four of those coordinate pairs is just to um, solve the system of equations as there are four um, equations that you need to solve. You can have more than uh, four pairs of coordinates. That just kind of helps um, the warping um, get more uh, more accurate and kind of reduce our our penalty when we're doing the regression. Um, so um, after that uh, I used feather blending um, to paste the original image um, back on top of the newly warped image now that they're in the same kind of perspective. Um, and I also I used a mask um, because sometimes when you were warping an image and pasting it on top of something else um, there'd be some artifacting because if you paste a warped image part of that rectangle um, of that image might be black um, due to that warping and not filling up the entire space. So using a mask um, just kind of removes that artifacting from being too big of an issue. And then finally, um, this combined image is going to be used as the base for the next iteration of this process. So here's one example of the panoramic stitching that I was able to accomplish. Um, here we are down on Weaver Street, some of you may recognize this, but um, so here are the five individual images, as you can see, all very similar, but um, at slightly different angles. And then uh, stitching them all together, I was able to achieve this um, effect, which, which honestly I think came out pretty good. Uh, I would say the most rewarding part of this was, was just kind of going through the process. Um, you know, we all have the pano uh, effect on our phone, so this was kind of an interesting, you know, project to kind of uncover how it all works. Um, but then I'd say the most challenging part was definitely uh, the, the stitching it together. Um, as you can see, there's still a little bit of artifacting um, or overlap on the lines um, where they are stitched. But I, I think the warping uh, came out pretty good. Um, like, like the image itself is very clear as to, um, you know, where it is and, and the perspective all seems to be right. It's just those lines that were giving me a hard time. Um, but yeah, that about does it for my project. Thank you very much.